Today, I'm in Makunduji, the place whereby Mwaka Koga Festival takes place in Zanzibar. If you really want to know the history of Mwaka Koga Festival and how people are celebrating it, watch out my video. The island of Unguja and Pemba, both known as Zanzibar, have a wealth of traditional and culture. One of the oldest traditional festivals is celebration of Mwaka Kogwa. The festival shows clearly the arrival of New Year according to Shiraz calendar. Shiraz were the first people to settle in Zanzibar. They were from Persia, what is now Iran. When the Persians reached Zanzibar, they settled Tumbatu, Makunduchi, and others, they went to Pemba Island. Later on, Persians mixed bloody with the local people, that's why Many aspects of Shirazi culture absorbed by Swahili people like Mwaka Kogwa. Mwaka Kogwa is an old traditional festival bought here Zanzibar by Shiraz people from Persia. The place whereby Mwaka Kogwa festival takes place in Zanzibar is Makunduchi. People from different places are going there for watching, enjoying and celebrating different events of such kind of festival. The festival is celebrated every July in a year and lasted about four days. Not only that, but also the purpose of Mwaka Kogo Festival is that to bring good luck in New Year. During the festival, there is a special open space whereby men of the village beat each other by using banana sticks. For many years ago, really sticks were used as a weapons, but now sticks have been replaced by banana sticks. The interesting things about beating each other is that it needs no referee because when one feels like he has had enough beating, he simply raises his both hands and surrenders or change his weapon for better one and continues fighting. While men of the village beating each other, women singing traditional songs about family, love and joy with the amazing local clothes. When men finish fighting by banana sticks, it's believed that there will be no conflict in New Year. A New Year will start with a peace and harmony. And also, most of headmen in Makunduji believe that if there will be no celebration of Mwaka Kogwa in their village, there will appear different problems like disease, for example fever, plants will never grow well, and the crops will be disappeared in their village. Thank you so much for watching my video. I hope you enjoyed well, so don't forget to subscribe, share, and comment on my YouTube channel because you will never miss any new videos from Musam Somali.